Well, I just took the uh, valve uh, covers off. That's what these are. These are considered valve covers for uh, like cylinder heads off the uh, find those on flathead engines. And what I discovered was let me turn. Piston moves, but uh, this intake valve is completely damaged. Don't even work. I think that's bad. This intake don't even move, so it has no compression. Let me see lube. Let's see. Shit. Piston. On this solder. Don't even uh, don't even go don't even do anything. Doesn't move at all. <laughs> Pushed it back just to, uh... And that, and there, and that's gotta be a bad connecting rod. <laughs> Point in reality, this engine is completely fucked. Try and fix that engine. That's gonna probably definitely cost probably. And I did. I did uh, drain the gas tank into a can. Well, let's just do. Uh, that's just to get access to uh, this one head here. Valves work. <laughs> valve on the other side's damaged. Valves on heat on oh on both valves here on this side uh, works. And yeah, it's probably a bad connecting rod. <laughs> connecting rod's probably bad. It's not even worth. It's not. Even, it's. It's gonna be. Pain, it's gonna be. It's gonna cost too much to fix anyway. <laughs> I say. I say if you got. If you know. Anybody out there knows about Briggs and Stratton products. This is like uh, 16 horsepower. It says twin two industrial commercial engine. Say cast iron sleeve and all that. If anybody knows about uh, these particular brakes and strap models, if anybody knows what would be a good combo replacement engine for these, let me know anyway. Which uh, model? Who cares about uh, the engine size? Which one would be suitable to replace the fix this? If if if, uh, if anybody's got that, please let me know. Okay. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Because uh, you'll find more for sure. That I can guarantee.